In this video, I'll show you how to add music to your Roblox game. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like. And let's jump straight into this guide. The first thing you need to do is come to Roblox and then go and tap on create and then you're going to be on my creations or make sure you select my creations and then you need to go and find the game or the experience which you want to go and add music to. So in this case I want to go and add music to the tutorial obby. So then what I'm going to do is come across and go and tap on edit just like so and go and open up Roblox Studio. It will take a moment to launch just like so. So sit back and wait. So here it is the Roblox Studio is now logging me in and my game is now loading. So here it is. It's just like a simple sort of template obby but you get the idea we can go and add music to it now what you need to do is come over to the right hand side to where you've got this option for explorer and you need to go and open up the um, workspace so go and tap on this downwards arrow here and then you need to go and tap on this plus just like so and what we need to do is type in sound we want to go and add um, a sound object so go and tap on sound just like so and as you can see sound has now appeared so we've gone and added that we actually need to go back to roblox so go and open up your web browser again and stay on the develop and create page just like so so tap on create again if you've gone off it and then what you need to do is on this top bar of options is go and tap on create a marketplace just like this then come to this top navigation bar or carousel of options and go and tap on audio and you've got sound effects and music so if you want music which we want go and tap on music just like so then you can go and scroll down and you can go and preview it to go and see if you go and like the sound of the music. So I quite like this top one here, Life in an Elevator. So once you've found one you like, then what you need to do is go and tap on more info, just like so. Then what you need to do is come to your URL bar. As you can see, we've got it at the top. And what you need to do is go and copy this set of numbers after asset. So in between these slashes, do not include the slashes, but all you want to do is put your mouse in it and go and highlight the numbers just like so, and just like that. Then right click and go and press copy just like so. Now let's come back to the Roblox Studio and then what you need to do is come over to the right hand side to the Explorer and go and tap on sound just like so. And then, and then once you've clicked on sound, go below Explorer into properties and then here we are. And then what you need to do is look for something called sound ID. So as you can see here it is under asset. And then what you want to do is go and click next to it and we get a text box. And then you want to go and paste the ID we just copied just like so. Then go and hit enter just like so and it's going to go and take a moment for it to load. Then what I recommend doing is going and tapping on this preview button just here to go and make sure it's the right sound that you want to go and use. And in this case it is the sound I want to go and use which is great it means we've added it correctly. And what I recommend doing as well is making sure you come down to playback and going and looping it as well. So this means once the song ends it's then going to go and restart again which is ideally what you want. And you can go and change all these other settings as well but I just want to go and show you the basics of using it. Then the next thing you want to do is go and look for service script service which is just here so go and tap on it and then you want to go and tap on this plus button just here then go and tap on script just like so and then we go and open this up now this is a lot more straightforward than you probably think then all you need to do is type in game just like so then hit dot and after you press game you need to go and tap on workspace or type in workspace with a capital just like so and then go and press dot again and then as you can see it gives us these options here and we've got sound so type in sound because we've created a sound and then you need to do a colon just like so and then you need to go and type in play just like so it basically explains what you need to do and then go and hit enter just like so and when you hit enter it's going to go and add in those brackets just like so automatically when you hit enter and then it'll create a new line that doesn't really matter then that's literally it you can then go and close off of the script just like so and then let's go and test this out so let's go and press on play just like so i'll turn up my sound a bit uh, just like so then the game is going to go and launch and as you can hear the music is now playing i'll turn it off um, but yeah you can see this guide is working and then you can go and make that public and that's literally it guys that is how you can go and add music to your roblox game if you found this guide useful please go down below and leave a like peace